should be left well alone. Oh, I know very well how the secrets beckon so sweetly. Only an honest death will kill you now. from your wild curiosity.
Journal Entry 18 Foolish am I, disturbing the slumber of a strong beast. Thank God this be a nightmare and not the real Yarnum. Nevertheless, I will put an end to Lawrence. The nightmare has shifted. First it seemed to be a hunter's never-ending killing field. But now it feels like this place is where misdeeds come to die. Hey there guys, I'm Outlaw Dolphin and I just spent three hours trying to kill Lady Maria. Yeah, I can't wait to see that number count. It was worth it though, like... Ludwig was getting on my nerves. Lady Maria was testing my skill and... Quite frankly, I am super happy. Also because I have this. And I'm only using it in this form. So stick to the right of blush for now. And I noticed before I hold up the celestial dial, I do have some item descriptions to read, so I will do that right now. First of all, the guidance. The guidance room that I've been making use of for this fight. A carol rune discovered by old hunter Ludwig, along with the holy moonlight sword, boosts the amount of life recovered by rallying. When Ludwig closed his eyes, he saw darkness, or perhaps nothingness. And that is where he discovered the tiny beings of light. Ludwig was certain that these playful dancing sprites offered guidance, and emptied Ludwig's, Ludwig of his fears, at least in the midst of the hunt. And I don't know if I read this. Holy Moonlight Sword is not. Yeah, I've read this. And this, we'll read the Celestial Dial before we hold it up. A Celestial Dial that functions with a giant astral clock in the Grand Cathedral. When the dial is held up towards the astral clock, the clock will come to life and reveal the secret to the curious... to its curious interloper. I imagine that's us. Um, before I hold that up, Let's use these echoes and restock. Lord knows I did a lot of farming. Uh, coming back from the dream, I realize I... Um, during off-camera, I completed Adeline's quest which means I have a, a peculiar rune called Milkweed. Small increase in item discovery. Envisioned by Adeline, patient of the research hall. A transcription of inhuman sticky whispers that reveal the nature of a celestial attendant. Those who take this oath become a lumen wood that peers towards the sky, feeding phantasms in its luscious bed. Phantasms guide us and lead to further discovery. I'm going to check that out at some point. Right now I'm going to hold up the celestial dial. That's actually kind of cool. That's actually kind of disgusting. Where the fuck am I? So when are you... Is that Yarnum? The sky and the cosmos are one. 
Is this what the choir call the cosmos? See another one there. I saw a figure like him in the research hall. Bergenworth. So they built that grand cathedral like a like NASA would build a rocket ship. They built that to pierce the sky. That is pretty amazing actually so I'm now in a place that is none too fond of anyone <laughs> great There's the signs of hunters. A body. In none too good condition. is giving me the creeps. Oh! Blood vials nice, I'll take them. creatures will have no problem in surrounding me. I saw an item. 
Oh, we can get it through the wall. is a curious little place. doing that. Out. Maybe I can. But maybe I shouldn't. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, God. That should be a perma death. None too keen on these things. These barnacle covered creatures. one get around that thing that likes to eat. I imagine that is the way I want to go. Oh, okay.
two of the throwy guys. Stuck on the ramp again. And now run for my freaking life. Oh god, like that lamp. scary. Was that Simon on the floor? You. I'm afraid I've made a bunch of things. Clearly. Oh, I can hear the bell now. Bell. The beast hide assassin. He's after me. Again. And again. It never ends. <sighs> Please. I need you to do something. This village is the true secret. A testament to the old sins. It feeds this hunter's nightmare. Okay. Please. Bring to an end the horror. So our forefathers sin. The hunters cannot bear their weight forever. So you want me to exorcise this nightmare? I suppose. Simon's bow blade and the underground cell inner chamber key. I think I know who and what he's talking about. Let's read those items he just gave us. Key to the inner chamber of the cell below the Grand Cathedral. The innermost chamber of the underground cell holds a, holds a lone man. A lone madman. He wears the beast hide and rings a bell that emits no sound. Unending death await those who hear the soundless bell. Choice weapon of Simon. One of the first healing church hunters. Simon despised firearms and so the church workshop had the specially fashioned to his liking. A large curved blade serves as a bow when, when transformed, but aside from a few close friends Simon was scoffed at for his choice of arms. For who would dare face the beasts with a measly bow? Oh, it's skill. I've already made a plus nine holy moonlight. I've already made my decision. I couldn't make something else plus nine even if I wanted to at this point. I probably could, it'd probably just take a very long time. Right, let's go deal with that madman. Okay, so let's work our way backwards through the research hall. From the research hall, rather. How are they dead? Oh, that might be how. This is interesting. Oh, he's got all the poison there. Whoa. Man, 
don't like lightning, do ya? Oh, dive right through that though. Oh, guide me, Rador's testimony. This sword is wow. 700 damage. I can hear it now. I believe you killed my only friend. Look who's here. Welcome to my quarters. I've never entertained a guest before. Are you going to kill me? After all you've done, you kill me. As if to right your wrongs. <laughs> I think there's one thing you failed to take into consideration. For all my sins, for all I've done, you speak of the church, the hunters, everything of Yarnum. I'm an outsider. Changes. Such is the nature of man. blood letter. Imagine this was the weapon he was using. Yep. The demented hunter weapon brandished by Brador, the healing church assassin. The blood letter assumes its true and terrifying form after it draws upon blood from the inner reaches of one's body and soul. This is the only effective means of expelling tainted blood. Or so Brador isolated in his cell, continued to believe. Oh, he's not going to assassinate anyone no more. He got rinsed by this, in his spirit form. I do wonder if this key that was given to me can open any more doors. It can't. That's a shame. Oh well. I think I should do right now is take a break. Because Lord knows Lady Maria put me round the ringer a lot. There we go, guys. I will catch you on I don't think there's much not much more for us to do I think it's just fishing Hamlet and then everything that I take from that then German and then that's it